Theranos founder Elizabeth Holmes appeared in federal court in San Jose this week, setting the stage for her criminal fraud trial in the coming months. A pregnant Holmes appeared in court for the first time in 15 months as she faces several counts of conspiracy and wire fraud allegations for her role in a multi-million dollar scheme to defraud investors with blood testing lab services. Theranos made its fortune by claiming it would be able to provide instant blood test results, offering patients a reliable and cheap way to receive vital information to make informed health decisions. Prosecutors say Holmes and Bawani allegedly made false claims to its investors that the Palo Alto-based company would revolutionize medical laboratory testing through innovative methods for drawing blood, testing blood, and analyzing patient data. Prior to the allegations, Theranos was valued at more than $9 billion. The judge is expected to make a decision this week on more than two dozen motions on which evidence jurors will be presented for Holmes' trial on August 31st. One motion from Holmes' lawyers aims to block evidence of her wealth, spending, and lifestyle from the jury. At one point, Holmes was considered the youngest female billionaire with an estimated net worth of $4.5 billion. But everything came crumbling down in 2018 when a Wall Street Journal investigation revealed that patients were making medical decisions based on fraudulent test results. Reporting in downtown San Jose for Cron 4 News, Omar Perez.